So we're over here at the food plot, and I think today we're gonna broadcast us some beans and a little bit of fertilize, and so we're gonna see how it goes. Man, as you can see in this time lapse over at the food plot, I just disted up this area and then we drove the har behind the disc and some type of thing that flattens out the dirt. It's actually looking way better than it did about two years ago when we first started using the disc. The ground looks about uh, pretty good and uh, we're gonna put some uh, soybeans out here because there's, there's a pretty good amount of moisture. If you can see, it's not like real white, it's a little bit dark brown brownish so that means there's a little bit of moisture in there so i'm gonna help my grandpa put some soybeans in there as you can see right here and i'm gonna uh disc over them again and plant them down into the dirt and cover them up so they can germinate so how we're doing this is we just have some beans in this bucket and i just throw it out there and we're basically broadcasting the beans and then we're uh so that's basically it, all there is to it and we just do this until the whole entire little half acre maybe quarter acre lot is full and then we'll, we'll just get it back on the tractor and cover them up So if you're wondering what the food plot looks like, here's a couple of sunflowers that we planted. It, uh, it's not the ones that I planted and shown on video, but as you can see, they're uh, coming up pretty good. And then here's some corn. It is uh, coming up pretty good too. Not like no uh, real farm. Like if it was a real farm, it would be real high, but we haven't really put any nitrogen or anything in this dirt. We did put a little bit of fertilizer. Uh, I don't see any tassels. And I do notice that the corn is pretty dry. We need to find a way to water it, but we have not uh, found that way yet. And they are uh, covered in weeds underneath, which is, uh, isn't really helping it, anything. But we'll figure out uh, what to do. It, this is just mainly for cover to make the deer feel hidden. It's not really uh, to make it to where uh, they can eat something. But if they want to eat it, they can, uh, they can eat it if they want to. And if you're wondering, we do have the uh, trail camera set. It's right there on that pole. We have gotten a couple pictures. Uh, we got a couple of does, and we also have, I think, two or three different bucks. It's hard to tell, but each of them have like a little nub with two points sticking up on each side, and they're both the same. So that's pretty good. Maybe it'll come into a super big buck, but I don't really know yet, uh, but we'll find out. And if you're wondering, the apple tree that we planted, I don't know, probably two years ago or something, it has made some significant progress. As you can see, this is pretty, uh, way bigger than it was before. So that is pretty good. I don't know how long until it does make something. We do need to find another tree to put out here because it won't be able to make anything without any pollination from another tree. But that tree died that we planted alongside it because of some ants. So we'll probably go to Lowe's or something and find another apple tree to plant out here. So 
it's been about a week and in this area right here you can see the beans are actually doing pretty good i mean you can see a couple uh, pieces of grass but here is a bean if you're wondering and there's some uh, just beans everywhere and that's a pretty good sign uh, a bad sign is we haven't had any rain and all the corn is drying out but if we get some rain in the probably next three days or so which i think it's forecast i think it will uh, come back up green but because it's still a little bit green so we'll see how it does and the little patch of sunflower is a little bit bigger than it was earlier as you can see it was like down smaller but it is coming up about a foot tall or so so that's also a pretty good sign so we'll see what happens next we'll see if it rains and so make sure you like and subscribe watch out for some more of my content um, and share this video with some of your friends or your peers and have a great day